Good morning. It is Monday, July 1st. Happy July. And I woke up early today. I woke up at 5 and did my yoga, did my usual routine. Um, but I, I realized that I want to start making my business a priority in the morning as well. So if I can just spend like 30 minutes on my business, then that is a good start to my day. And I'm listening right now to Natalie Bacon's podcast, Design Your Dream Life, The Online Business Puzzle. Um, I really like her as a blogger, so I um, forgot she had a podcast. But for the next 30 minutes or so, it's only 6.11, and I don't leave until 6.45-ish. Uh, I'm probably going to schedule some pins, maybe write an email. I'm not sure yet, but this is... I don't typically wake up early to work on my blog just because I'm usually tired, but I feel fine today. Got some water, already packed my lunch. Like I literally just, I'm good to go. So it's like, I don't have to, you know, worry about packing my lunch or anything. I just get to work. Good afternoon, it's Monday afternoon. And I just spent the last hour I ate a pre-workout snack and I finished a blog post, got it published, and I wrote a whole email to my blog subscribers and got that sent out for scheduled for tomorrow morning. Now I'm just writing um, a couple of blog posts, maybe for the next uh, month. Not writing blog posts, I'm just planning out what I want to write for the next month or so. And yeah, I need to go down to the gym. I physically hurt, like my feet physically hurt. I think it's from the sprints that I did yesterday with Sebastian, but I don't know, I just feel, I guess I just feel a bit tired, but if I go work out, I know I'll feel a lot better and it's leg day, so um, I gotta go ASAP before this food goes out of my system. So I'm gonna spend a few more minutes here. I'm always at in this spot, I'm sorry. <laughs> and come back up and get more work done. Good morning, I just woke up, it's five in the morning and um, I am about to do my yoga, but this commercial came on for the Game Changers trailer and you guys should go look it up. Someone asked me, how could you get as strong as an ox without eating any meat? And my answer was, have you ever seen an ox eating meat? That's so exciting. They're like, it's a movie promoting a plant-based diet and like Arnold Schwarzenegger is in it. It's all these athletes that like have gone vegetarian or vegan. That's so exciting. It says it's coming in September. I'm excited. Anyways, I just used 10 minutes in my morning, so let me get to my yoga. This is really weird, but it's, what time is it? What time is it? 7.20 p.m. I'm craving... I'm fine, just hung I'm hungry, and I, I guess I, I don't know, I didn't get to make my rice this week, I don't think I even showed it, no I didn't, I didn't even talk about it, there were flower beetles in my rice, like infested, not hundreds, but you know, maybe a good 50 getting there, I saw some, some larva, so I just threw the whole thing out unfortunately, so I don't have rice for the week. But I don't think I've been eating enough, and um, like it, it should be enough, but for me it's just never enough. Uh, so I'm making hot chocolate, I know that's weird on like a random July day, but I have some oat milk, I just microwaved that, gonna put my hot cocoa in. But anyways, I'm like really eager to learn languages, and I just like... I get so frustrated because there's so much that I want to do in life and I just, I can't do it all, obviously. And like with me focusing so much on my business lately, um, which I have been, like any moment that I get, I am working on something with my business. And that's great, but I like, I've been, it's taking me away from practicing Spanish which I obviously really want to learn and I want to learn Farsi, which is, uh, my dad is Iranian and unfortunately I was not raised speaking Farsi. Um, so it's kind of sad and I, <laughs> I was just like looking up classes and stuff and the prices are really good for these 
classes, but it's just, you know, I gotta figure out if I should make that a priority right now or I don't know. I just really want to learn Spanish first because it's easier and I think I can apply it more just on a day-to-day -day basis, not just with my boyfriend and his family, but with, you know, a lot of people in America. But then Farsi I would like to learn as well because that would be pretty cool and I do wish I knew it because um, that's half of me. So anyways, I'm going to drink my hot cocoa and work through my little course right now. Hello, it's Wednesday, July 3rd. <sighs> Let me sit down. With tomorrow being July 4th, I got to leave work early today, about an hour early. So it's only 2.35 and I have tomorrow off, obviously. I'm a little bit sleepy right now, but um, I might take a nap. I don't know, Sebastian is coming over after work today and then he's probably gonna stay with me um, through Sunday just because he has tomorrow off and then we're both going back to work on Friday but but he works closer to where I live than where he lives unfortunately the sky is already cloudy like the sky is just basically a white gray color because it's gonna rain for the and storm for the rest of the week and I hope at least tomorrow there is some sun some clearing so we can go to the pool on our day off or at least this weekend or something because I haven't been in a while but for now, I'm just going to work through that course that I keep talking about and just write. That's what I do best if I don't take a nap. Uh, but if I do take a nap, it'll only be like 30 minutes. We're going to go to the gym later after Sebastian gets here. So uh, that's my update for now. So just took a shower, made dinner. Sebastian's in the shower now. Um... I've been working on a PDF document. I'll show you actually, sneak peek. So it's looking like this. Pictures are not my pictures, I'm not using those. Um, but yeah, that's like the gist of it. It's gonna be a free PDF document. Um, but I've been, I spent like hours on that today. I feel weird for some reason. I don't know, I just feel like really sleepy and my body hurts. My tooth was hurting earlier, uh, which was just like frustrating me. I think I'm just tired, but I don't know, my whole body kind of like hurts. It's almost time for bed. <laughs> but we'll probably watch Breaking Bad and I'm still, I still want to wake up early tomorrow. like. Maybe just like an hour later, six o'clock instead of five. So I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, I just woke up. I didn't sleep very good between the fireworks all night and the dump trucks at like six in the morning taking the big dumpsters that they slam back onto the ground um, I'm gonna just work on my laptop until Sebastian wakes up and maybe we'll go down and get some coffee and I think it's I don't think it's gonna rain like expected uh, it's at 20% right now so hopefully we get to go out to the pool got some coffee. We're gonna go to Revolution Donuts, which is my favorite donut shop. It's the 4th of July, obviously, and um, I'm breaking my fast early, I guess. So that's that. Two. 
So I got strawberry shortcake and chocolate cake donut. What did you get? Peach something? That was peach something and then cream filled something. Cream filled something. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm eating dinner now. We finished Breaking Bad. I have no comment on that show. Not happy about it, let's just say that. I'm, I, I'm halfway happy, halfway not. Anyways, we went down to the pool for, how long were we there? An hour maybe? Yeah. Like an hour. It was really hot and really crowded. Um, it wasn't horrible, but so we were in the pool most of the time. And um, now I'm just sleepy because of the sun, I think. Good morning, happy Saturday. It's about eight o'clock, I just got back from grocery shopping and I picked up a new baby. Look how cute, it's a money tree. Um, and it's supposed to bring good fortune, but I just think it's really cute and New addition to the family gotta think of a name. I'm thinking something basic like money or cash Probably cash. I don't know. Anyways Didn't film anything yesterday um, I worked it was like a really slow day at work obviously not much to do the day after a holiday and then um I was really tired yesterday, like I didn't feel good. So I took a long nap, uh, both me and Sebastian did. And then we took a trip to Walmart, picked up some detergent, and I got some, got some matches. Because I wanted a lighter, but I don't want to use the plastic. I'm trying to reduce, I'm trying to reduce my plastic consumption as much as possible, which sometimes is difficult. So I got those. Um, today I bought a bar soap with no packaging whatsoever. There was a sticker on it, but that was it. Just a small like barcode sticker. Um, so I got a body soap and then I got some, I got earth paste toothpaste, which is like, the packaging is a little bit more eco-friendly. I don't know. And of course, vegan, cruelty-free. I have some like gla old glass jars that I want to get the stickers off of and start using those. Yeah, anyways, uh, yesterday we went to the gym last night and then went to bed pretty early. Gonna go meet with my mom today, probably get a coffee, but I'm going with Sebastian and then later tonight we are going to my dad's house for food for dinner, which is exciting because food. <laughs> That's all for now. So I wanted, I've been wanting to paint something simple for my apartment. This wall, yeah, you can see it, this wall right here. And so I got an idea from a tattoo. Actually, this was on Pinterest. Looks like this. So that is what I want to paint. Well, I'm first gonna draw it and then just paint over it in black. So I just want black and white. Um, yeah. And we're about to watch The Grinch. <laughs> uh, the new one. The cartoon that came out last December. This was Sebastian's choice. So... <laughs> yeah. So random. Because he said something nice. Okay. Painting is finished. Did not go as planned. I tried to draw that that girl with her flower head uh, five times and then I tried another one that was similar once and I just got frustrated so I went to something a little bit easier. Here's the final product. So uh, I actually, this is like I copied a, another outline drawing thing um, but it was just black and white so I figured I would try to watercolor the green so it's like uneven edges which I like the green part 
Um, and then right now I'm trying to lay out like how I want to decorate this wall um, because I have a couple of printables which I actually designed. So a few months ago I had created a bunch of, uh, I, obviously I didn't create the quotes, but I had designed a bunch of these little printables. So I I made a total of 10 of them, so I'll link my little Etsy shop down below. These are only a few bucks, and you get four different size prints. And I got these printed at Office Depot, so there's no rain, no flowers. Expect nothing, appreciate everything. And then the best view, com best view comes after the hardest climb. And um, I got these in, I think it was like 28 weight paper or 26. Uh, it was like one step higher up than basic paper, like 24. And then uh, these frames are actually just from Walmart. I got like, uh, maybe each of these was two or three bucks or so. And I think that's what all that we're gonna put in my living room. So yeah. I'm excited. I also have these little tapestry things that I was gonna put in the living room, but it won't really go well with that painting. So I figured we'll put these somewhere else. Uh, but my camera is about to die. Morning, so. it's Sunday. We just did fasted cardio. Uh, I did the Peloton for 30 minutes and it was really intense, like too intense that I just didn't, I didn't enjoy it. <laughs> But I got through it. I can't say I, I reached all of the little cadence and resistance points correctly, but I did it. And about to shower last night, we went to my dad's house and um, it was a good time. We ate a lot of food as usual, brought home a lot of food as usual. Got home around, my dad lives like 45 minutes from me, maybe an hour, I don't even know. But we got home a little past 11 and just went to bed um, and woke up kind of early. Sunday, typical Sunday routine, going to meal prep and clean and probably do some work for my blog because I have not in a couple of days. So yeah, that's it for now. I'm pretty hungry, so I'm, I might, I don't feel good. Like if I, I went too hard for being fasted I think and I might need to I'll probably like eat some fruit at least to break my fast because I feel weird I don't want to like black out <laughs> I apologize for my um, gremliness but it's now What are we doing over there? All right, if you hear banging, I don't know, it's my neighbors. They must be hammering frames on the wall. I don't know. But it's about 5.30 now, and Sebastian left a few hours ago, around two o'clock, and I have been working. Um, I was planning a blog post, researching on that, and then I just like emailed my blog subscribers while well, I wrote one and scheduled it to go out. Um, I did meal prep uh, and I just finished cleaning up so I vacuumed the whole house or <laughs> vacuumed the whole apartment and like tidied everything up and I just made some dinner. So uh, it's kind of random but um, Greek inspired. Obviously a bed of spinach and then I have some baked potato pieces as well as falafels. These are from Boca. They're so good. And then on top I put um, kale pesto hummus, which just tastes like pesto to me. And then I squeezed fresh lemon juice all on top. And it smells really good and looks really good. So I'm going to eat this and probably watch a YouTube video while I do that. Um, and just work for the rest of the night probably. And you know, typical Sunday routine. <laughs> I have made my way back to the couch. Uh, I just took a shower. It's 7 o'clock and I think I'm going to end the video here just because I want to put these files onto my computer. I had such a good 
weekend. <laughs> uh, it felt like a long weekend just because I had Thursday off and then, you know, Sebastian was with me all four of those days. And um, obviously I don't see him except for on the weekend. So like when I get extra time with him, that's always something that I appreciate. And uh, we did so much, I feel, over these past few days, especially yesterday. And yesterday was just like a really good day overall. We woke up early, got so much done. And um, like I saw everybody in my family, which was nice. And it just felt like a really long day. And typically, um, both of us are like, we like to stay in a lot. So typically we just like gym. Sometimes we'll go to the pool or whatever. It depends where we are. And then we'll just watch Netflix or just stay in. But we like, you know, didn't watch any Netflix really. Um, and chose to use our free time for something more productive. Like, you know, I did all this stuff, which I'm going to film an apartment tour, by the way, don't you worry. Uh, but I will finally, like my, my apartment is basically complete. So, um, as complete as it will get for myself, but, um, yeah, we like painted and it was just like, I really enjoyed it and I just had a good really good weekend so I am very grateful for that and ready to get through this next week uh, my birthday is in a few days so that's exciting again I'll get to see um, my family more this week and probably go out to eat or something but yeah that's really that's really it for today I am still gonna just get some work done for the rest of the night a couple of hours until I go to bed and I really want to read because I feel like I haven't read in a couple of days. But that's going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching another week in my life. And I will see you guys in my next video.